Hi guys, today we're going to be showing you how to change your motor in your MadSpeed Exceed RC. The motor we're going to be using is a upgraded brushless motor and let's get started guys. The first thing we need to do is remove these eight screws. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. So go ahead and take them out using your Allen head screwdriver. And once you have those screws removed, you can take out this plastic covering, which will, exp which will expose your motor mount. Next, we need to take out these two screws to remove the motor. After you've taken out those two screws, you can go ahead and pull your motor out. And now we need to remove the motor mount itself from the motor. Once you've loosened the mount, you need to remove your pinion gear by taking out this grub screw. Once you have your, piston, your pinion gear removed, your motor mount will come right off. Next, we're going to mount the motor to the motor mount using the screws that we took off earlier. Once you have the motor mounted, you want to go ahead and reinstall your, your pinion gear. Go ahead and slide it on the shaft and secure it using the grub screw. And next we're going to mount the motor back in place. Go ahead and place your motor in the motor mount in the slot it was in before. And now you want to kind of rotate your motor back and forth to make sure you get a good gear mesh. You can test your gear mesh by rolling the car. Once you feel that you have a pretty good gear mesh, you can roll your car back and forth and listen for the sound that it makes. And if you don't hear any grinding noise, that means you have a pretty good gear mesh. Like right now. Once you feel like you have a pretty good gear mesh, you want to go ahead and re-secure this mount using these two screws. And you're going to screw them into the two nuts from underneath. 
Once you have your motor mounted, you can go ahead and reinstall this plate. And we're going to secure it using the eight Allen head screws that we took out earlier. And after you've finished reinstalling those eight Allen screws, you're done reinstalling your new motor. Thanks for watching guys, stay tuned for more instructional videos from Nitro RCX.